Mark Leitner, and today we're looking at Dragon Box Numbers, a, an exciting new early math, early numeracy experience from We Want to Know. Those are the people that made Dragon Box Algebra. <laughs> This is an absolutely delightful tutorial because there's no way to fail and all of a sudden another object comes down and you are sort of walked into the complexity of the math. This whole experience is inspired by a tool that every elementary teacher knows and that's they're called Cuisinaire Rods, uh, numbered sticks that all relate to one another. So by freely exploring and feeding the different blocks each other, you start to understand the basic idea of addition and subtraction. After I've completed the tutorial, it's off to the puzzles. And that's where I start to discover that they start easy, they get hard, and there's an Angry Birds style record keeping. All your progress is bookmarked you for four different players, and you can't access one of the harder ones until you earn enough coins. Um, now, you, now, that in itself is another great lesson in place value, um, perfect example of an embedded reinforcement. This is one of the easier puzzles here. I'm learning that if I need more um, one blocks, I can just grab them. Now I earned a coin, and that gives me enough money to unlock the next level. Here's another harder level, and uh, slightly harder, and the added bonus is that you actually make numerals. There's a whole other set of letters, and then you can move into different uh, shape puzzles that can get quite complicated, which I'll show in a second. Here's one of the harder puzzles. This time it uses a step counter, so every time I tap the tube, I get a, a higher number. All of the different numeral uh, attributes are labeled clearly, and always this app goes out of its way to help sort of make the connection between their manipulation of the different graphic objects and the number concepts. As we noted in our review this morning, there were a few things that we thought could be improved in this app. One is obviously the sound control. We think uh, Maria Montessori would love the pedagogy, but she would cringe at the um, pushing of the music at the kids. So now I've earned a, quite a few coins, enough to unlock one of the harder levels. So you can see that this app takes every opportunity to help children make the connections even in the way that the ex extrinsic reinforcers are used in the form of money. You don't have to worry about any licensed content. There are no gimmicks in this app. It, it does cost a lot. Uh, $8 is the current price. Um, what you get in return is some amazing pedagogy and some real innovative techniques to help children make the connection between the, their manipulations and number concepts. There are two additional modes available from the main menu. One is called Ladder, and that lets you really experiment with some challenges that are more structured. In that case, I, I need to reach that star, which I do by building blocks, and there's a lot of ways to combine the different units, and that also lets me earn coins. There's also a sandbox mode which, which lets you experiment and compare and contrast any way you want. 
If you're a preschool or kindergarten teacher, you might consider having a set of unit blocks or cuisine rods nearby uh, where this app is in the classroom. When you go beyond the age gate, you, you see you can change uh, language options as well as set up up to four user profiles. Progress is bookmarked automatically. So there you have it, one of the best early math experiences we've reviewed uh, so far this year, and if we could only do something about that background music, we'd have a phenomenal experience. This is Warren Buckleitner. We'll see you next time.